Good evening, everyone. Today is Tuesday, June 2nd, 2020. Shawal Day 10. Vlog number 1157. I'm deciding and uploading the vlog from yesterday, so by the time you're watching this video, yesterday's vlog should already be up. Please be sure to go check it out. Don't forget to like, share, comment, and subscribe. I was hungry, so I made some pasta. I'm gonna eat that with a Coke. And I'm starting to finish up doing all of, like my little chores. Um, I still got like a bunch of trash that's still kind of ongoing, but um, I did start putting in more dishes and I unloaded the dish, the first load of dishes. Once I have like all of my dishes like washed and I have an idea of like what all everything is and like an inventory of everything um, and organized, um, I'm gonna clean up in here and that way I won't have to do so much cleaning. Um, then I am going to wait for my furniture to come and then I'm going to put some curtains up. So I was thinking and I don't think I'm going to put any curtains on this, on the slide doors at all. I'm just going to be on the windows. For now, unless I like drastically change like the slide doors to something that didn't have blinds already on it. So, crazily enough, um, my Swiffer thing on the bob, it comes with like a vacuum too, right? So you push a button and it has the suction on it as well alongside the mop. <laughs> anyway, um, like my other story aside, I, I turned it on today and it sort of, you know, it sort of vacuumed up some of the stuff in the other room um but then it died <laughs> like right then and I barely moved it a couple of spots so it's on the charger right now and then my my other story with the with how it's sort of like I was using the mop to like vacuum up and clean up but it was I'm pretty sure it was on like a carpeted area Anyway, even if it wasn't, I turned on the vacuum at the same time that I used like the wet mop and I think some of the, I didn't think it would happen, but like some of the moisture from the mop, the wet Swiffer mop thing, it went into the suction of the vacuum. So it was just like the biggest fail ever. I didn't think anything of it. I thought it was that was what you're supposed to do with it is turn on the vacuum at the same time that you're mopping. And I turned it off for a second and flipped the thing over and the part where the vacuum part where dry particles would go, there was like a whole thick line of mud, of like clay or whatever. And sort of like my state that I was in like health wise my reaction was of when I look back on it now I still can't even describe how pissed I was when I sit in this chair every single time my ankle gets caught on the middle you know what I mean like where I don't know anything about chairs or like how they work but whatever there's like a screw or a bolt or something that every time i put my foot across it it gets stuck on it it hurts so badly i'm gonna have to set up an entertainment center i hate them so much it's like tv is furniture and it's not cute it's not cute it's never cute um so I gotta find something that's cute. I ate that pasta and I'm still hungry. Just waiting for my Swiffer to get recharged so I can see what it can do for me. And I gotta find a place to like set up the entertainment center. I just don't like I just don't know where I'm gonna end up putting um, that stuff. I'm actually in, in the process of unpacking that stuff right now. It's in a box sitting i'm thinking i'm just gonna put it onto 
the fireplace because I'm tired of having it like put up and stuff because I'm getting ready to use it. I don't care. So, um, yeah, I think I'm just going to take it out. There's like so many different ways to like organize um, the entertainment stuff. Like I could have like a stand where I would put my Wii U on top of it. It's like a Wii U controller um, or something. And then have it just plugged into the wall and be charging all the time, I guess. That would be cute. Well, let's see what else all I have and what else all I'm gonna have. I know for sure a DVD player. I don't know what else. You know how bad the lighting is in here? Oh my god, it's so inconvenient. Um, Alright, so I have my Swiffer thingy plugged in. So I'm gonna just look at the bottom of it right now. And I'm gonna see that there's like, oh, I must have cleaned it up already. Yeah, I think I cleaned it up, but it's like really cool. You guys, um, you just push it down like that or whatever. It raises up like this, you can clean the bottom of it. Ow, oh my God. I smashed my big toe. That was not good. I hate those nail salons. They like are so disgusting. I'm pretty sure like every time I go there, I get like a freaking infection from them. Anyways, well, anyways, that thing sort of bends up. I can't really do it on camera because of my hands being too full. Let's see? So, yeah. And then it won't turn on if it's plugged in, so I'm gonna unplug. And like, let's see if it gets this big ass. Not bad, I guess. It's really not. Wow. That's probably like a huge problem that I have, which is like my allergy situation. Um, the cat stuff, like I can deal with it if it doesn't really like suck up all the cat crap, the litter. That's okay, but this bunny situation, I thought I was going to have to sweep it as well, and it's like so stupid. Ooh. It's really good, actually. Oh my god, thank god. I'm literally saved because um, that stuff gets in your nose, man, and it is... It is very futile. <laughs> I think it's that like large clump of clay right there. Probably not. I think it knows like if something is going to be too big, so it doesn't like. It doesn't vacuum up that stuff, but look at those dust bunnies, man. Whoa. I'm really satisfied. Hopefully it stays hard. That's the only thing. Like it died as soon as I turned it on earlier. I don't know how long it's on charge with right now. That sucks, so I'm gonna have to get that out of my hand. But not really too bad. I wonder if it's so heavy. I was thinking it was just gonna be some stupid thing, but. Because the first time that I used it, it was such a fail. Also, because I don't vacuum very much. <laughs> If it runs out and then start using it again. Oh my god, my floor is so clean.
also solves like major like hair problems too. So that's like a big plus if you're someone like me. And I didn't even break this one. The weird thing about using this thing when I first got it was um, a false alarm. It suddenly turned off and I was like, I mean, with any conventional vacuum, that doesn't happen. So I was like, crap, this is a piece of crap. I knew it because I only paid, I think it was only like 20 bucks actually. <laughs> so um, anyway, because uh, I thought it was the wet jet. So whatever. Anyway, because um, I wanted the wet jet. I didn't want this one. And, um, but then like I pushed the button and it turned back on. Um, and right now it just did that and good thing I recalled that that's what happened um, with this product but I like push the button and it'll come back on so I don't know what the deal is about that um, I don't think I'll ever know but I just put it back on the charger I'm gonna let it charge for like a little while longer so I can just kind of clean up a little bit more in here but that quickly for the charge that it did have on it it cleaned up like everything in here. It solves so many of my freaking problems. I hate sweeping. Um, so that is a really, really convenient. I mean, all the dust bunnies are gone. It feels like everything is just pretty much clean in this room. I literally can't believe it. So now like when I go in here, I'm gonna have to clean up obviously the same stuff, but it's not gonna be, like there was some litter tracking in here as well, but if it was dry, it was vacuumed and sucked up right away. So I'm pretty sure that that, 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 that is what's gonna happen in this room. Um, so that'll be one less thing for me to worry about. $20 well spent. I'll of course have to worry about like large clumps though. Um, but at least I don't have to worry about sweeping up like the dust bunnies. I don't know how people in the old days did it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's they just kind of swept it up with like a little a dustpan and like like one of those mini um, broom things, which I think I have as well. Um, but that is that thing is pretty useful for for this. It doesn't solve like all of my problems whatsoever. Like there's like paper and stuff everywhere. I, I'm always gonna have to like sort through stuff that's on the floor and make sure that it's not something important. Um, that I need to save otherwise it just goes in the trash. I do tend to walk around uh, pretty barefoot and I hate walking around on a dirty floor. It seems like it's a pretty good idea to have those both things together but I don't think I would like mop mop and vacuum at the same time. I'm pretty sure that I would just switch off so now I can just like now that like all those I mean I don't know if you saw but those dust bunnies were huge. Now that <laughs> And there were, there's a lot of them. So now that they're all gone, I can just like swap, uh, spot mop in there, like wherever I need to, because sometimes it's not. Um, when I was like really sick at my old place, and I didn't really like own up to that, um, I would be like in bed, right? And my cat, suspicious, because she's, she's weird. So she would like, Jigglypuff would come up to me. And she would just like, <laughs> like if I was a nurse, you know, she would come up to me and like be like, Sarah, are you okay? Literally, just she would check on me. And I, of course, in my denial stage was like, no, I'm fine and go back to sleep or whatever the hell I was doing in bed. I cannot tell the difference between clean air and not clean air, even though this room is completely clean air room. my hearth. <laughs> I'm actually getting so much use out of that thing. Um, I had to vacuum up a little bit over there by the kitchen um, door thing. Um, and over here. And of course the battery died again. I don't know why it's doing that. Um, but whatever. I'm still getting so much use out of it. Prince just like laying down next to it like I'm ready to make it dirty again. Which is not really his fault, um, 
he just, you know, I don't mind because he just does the, the kitty litter tracking and the t tiny, tiny little like balls of like clay everywhere. And those are, those are really easy to clean up using that little vacuum. And I just had to make some more pasta. So I'm going to have that for dinner. Um, hopefully that's going to be enough, but whatever the case may be, I don't feel like cooking anything right now just because I've been doing so much. Um, and yeah, I'm going to eat that. And I had some cake, probably going to just eat the rest of that like piece of cake that I had yesterday. It's a cool device because sometimes it'll leave out like little small pieces of whatever because sometimes the litter, litter obviously will become clumpy um or it's it just comes like that sometimes sometimes it just doesn't really always uh come in like small form um so it'll just like move that out of the way and vacuum up everything else like everything else anyways guys i'm gonna close the vlog please don't forget to like share comment and subscribe and i will talk to you guys on the next vlog